Welcome to Northamptonshire. It's park run day. Here we are on a glorious morning and I don't know if you'll see behind me or whether the sun is too strong, but we are by Pittsford Water or Pittsford Reservoir. We're here to do Bricksworth Country Park Run and I'm so excited because it already just looks ridiculously beautiful. I'm here with Doris and Poppy. I've just sent them off to the pay machines to figure out what we need for the car park. But we're here, down here for this weekend because of the Run Rabbit Trail Festival. So I'm on stage twice later on this evening. So we came down last night so that we could check out a new park run. Three pounds 20 for four hours. Do remember to bring coins because the contact us payment is not working. There's a lovely sort of musical nature garden up here by the cafe. Um, Poppy's already run off to the playground. Doris is playing on the sun clock. <laughs> and we're going by the team. I've never seen a human sun clock. Stand on the month and your shadow will tell the time. Red for winter, yellow for summer. Maybe need to do a bit of weeding, but that is pretty cool. Good morning, gnomes. We're just where all the park runners collect. So I'm just going to rescue this little snail Ooh, and put it by this post. There we go. You'll be happier there. Look at this dude. And I've come to attempt to extract Poppy from the playground so that we can do park run, but I don't fancy my chances because it looks pretty cool. Are you ready? <laughs> I've just heard an announcement that the first time as briefing is about to occur, so heading back up here, we're going to find out about the course. short and sweet, beautiful day, uh, the course is nice and clear, I've been told, a bit of a cheeky breeze, so just warning you. Who did in those volunteers? We've got a couple of paces, uh, we've Thank got you, a 28 minute pacer, uh, timekeepers ready? Three, two, one, part run! And we're off! What a beautiful day! What a brilliant start! Three, two, one, park run! <laughs> That's better than go, loving that! So Poppy's just invented a new game and it's can you jump but keep your head in the same spot? It's actually the best park run game that I have ever played. <laughs> it does tire you away, <laughs> what a great game. It's so lovely here, so peaceful. They said we need to stop at the turn around and take some pictures because it's beautiful. Yes. This is Jim. Um, who's doing park run even though he hasn't got running kit, which is amazing. We applaud you. It's like what I was saying in a video maybe a month ago. What are your real barriers and what are your perceived barriers? Not having running kit, fine. You may not be able to run it, but you can still get out here. Experience park run, get your 5k, spend some time outside with wonderful people. Poppy's explaining the rules for another park run game. Thank you, Marshall. Thank you, Marshall. 
We're running next to Pittsford Water. Um, it's actually a relatively new reservoir. I think it's 1956 it was built to feed water to Northampton. Um, and this country park is even more recent. I think it's like 1997. Um, we might have left the country park by now, have we? Maybe not. On the way back, we leave the edge of Pittsford Water and go through the country park. So it's sort of an out and back course. But on the way back, slightly different. <laughs> I'll put the course map in. If we see a snail on the path, we always have to move it because otherwise it might get trampled. So, snail rescue. Where's the new home going to be? Oh, by a tree. Snail will be happy there. We're over a mile in now. Um, just following this main track alongside Pittsford Reservoir and chatting to everybody. Lots of cyclists come in the other way. Super friendly, all cheering us on. What a lovely place to be. There are the most flies on this. Well done, guys. Trying not to. Did you just eat some flies? You're trying to battle your way through the flies. It's like a cloud, isn't it? Well done, guys. I can't explain to you how many flies there are. Well done. It's really hard not to eat them. I feel like my face and hair are covered in flies. Oh. Well done, guys. Totally worth it to be running here, though. Um, but I don't want to be eating them, no. <laughs> Have breakfast. We found a little hill. So we're walking up it. Oh, I'll probably just jog. <laughs> First rule of ultra running, walk the hills. <laughs> um, and I got a dolly or bed. Hooray, pod reference. <laughs> so I, of course, shouted arbitrary in reply. turning point 100 meters ahead and we can already hear it they've got like a horn do, 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 and whistles and that was a terrible horn impression but like there we go hopefully you heard that <laughs> let me film it for you yay it's a party at the turnaround point <laughs> <laughs> Yay, what a spot! <laughs> Sneaking off course! Oh my goodness! Did you just go through those flies? I couldn't breathe! Look at this view! That was worth it! Well done, Tail. Thank you for volunteering. This won't be our fastest run because we keep stopping for pictures. It's just too lovely. It is just too lovely. Now that the sun's come out. Oh, I don't want to run. Just want to stand here with this view. Pittsford Water, you are stunning. We've turned around and we're heading back. Doris is struggling to uh, run because she has to keep taking pictures as well. Pittsford Water is an SSSI, so a site of special scientific interest. So I feel really lucky when we're in places like this. Look at the reflection of the clouds. And it's just so peaceful. This is such a big part of our Park Run Day adventures. Just enjoying where we are, taking time out from the run. 
stopping, looking around. Poppy thought she saw some ducklings. So we went to check that out. It's seven and a half miles all the way around and oh, I'd love to do that. It's just the perfect day for it. But um, we need to get to the Run Rabbit Trail Festival and uh, we've got a bit of park faffing to do as well. So <laughs> really we need to finish the park run, get to the cafe and get on with our day. But it is hard <laughs> when you're in such incredible places. We're just checking in on the rescued snail. Still here. Looks happy. The puppy's happy. Successful rescue. Look at the sun glistening on the water. It's like glitter on the water. Oh, we are just loving it. Doris has stopped again to take a photo of something else. <laughs> it's just that sort of park run though. Just so much to see. Um, we must be turning right soon though and leaving the reservoir to go through the country park. So looking forward to that, despite being warned about the hills that lurk in the country park. Oh, is this the turning point? Yes, two little cones have now been put down, so this is where we turn into the country park. Thank you, Marsha. Well done, guys. Well done. There's a gorgeous breeze here, and we've found some thrones. So. Crack willow. Will you sit with me, child? Spider <laughs> web. Oh, the cobweb. And flies. Oh, cobweb and flies, but lovely park run resting point. What I would say is maybe those chairs are in the wrong place because we're going up a hill now. Oh, bug in my eye. Um, yeah, we're going up a hill now, so I'd quite like a rest at the top of the hill, not at the bottom of the hill. <laughs> there is a bench at the top of the hill. Jane's bench. Thank you, Jane. Slightly going off course, just to explore. But, two more thrones at the top of the hill. In the woods, though, so you need to come slightly off course. And a cool den. Oh. <laughs> My child is being attacked. <laughs> I got on the phone <laughs> At the top of that hill there's this beautiful viewpoint and then Jen's bench and then Paul's bench. <sighs> the most spectacular view. We're loving this park run. Well that's Probably my favourite bench of all, Grandad's bench. We're messing about too much, the tails have caught us up, so <laughs> but now we need to stay ahead of them. <laughs> but I think we're nearly there. I think this will probably be a few marshals here on the corner, and I think it might be our last corner. There is too much to see. Thank you so much. Thank you. <sighs> 200 meters to go. Let's get to that finish. Well, this is cheeky. From 200 meters to go to 100 meters to go, it's uphill. So tough sprint finish if you're running hard. Watching the sprint finish there. Oh, and it carries on uphill. The finish goes uphill all the way to the end, but there's one more thing to stop and look at. It explains the little gray men, so follow the path to join the last gnomes in England on their exciting adventure. And what a place to have an adventure. 
Poppy's printed off. <laughs> thank you guys, thank you so much. <laughs> I thought this lovely lady was um, giving me a token. She's not. She was giving me cake. This park run prioritizes cake over tokens. So this is my sort of park run. <laughs> what a finish area. Handed cake, given tokens, and we go to scan. Tail Walker is about to scan, but I'm just going to go and film him from behind, which seems unusual, but look at that tail. It's a good tail. <laughs> tail Walker should always have tails. Now, shall we film the putting down of the sign? <laughs> if you manage it, oh my goodness. So what happens if you come to Park Run looking this fantastically smart, you get the magic of the sign. That was, <laughs> that was amazing. Well done. <laughs> This is Jip, the co-ED. So Jip and Vicky, um, so that's why I can do the sign. Although um, you totally bluffed it and I thought you weren't going to be able to then. And then <laughs> you did it first time, super easily. Yeah. <laughs> what a park run. I just recorded some audio for the podcast with the team. We're going to go to the cafe, the willow tree just up here. <laughs> but look at this. How lucky are we? Two weeks in a row with absolutely perfect weather. Um, so I think we'll get something from the cafe and then either take it to the playground or um, sit outside and enjoy it because I want to be out in this lovely sunshine. Now that the sun is out, I've returned to the sun clock and I'm stood on May. And it's quarter past 10, look at that. Just after 10 o'clock. <laughs> I'm loving it. There you go, there's my dial. Quarter past 10. We're trying to get to the cafe, but there's too much to do. Poppy's making music. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this park is amazing. Oh, look at this. It looks like he's eating. <laughs> looks like he's eating because the plant is growing into his mouth. I've let Poppy choose breakfast, so what are we having, Poppy? Cake and chip butty. <laughs> Cake and a chip butty. So we've even got a smiley face that's going to let us know when our chip butty is ready. So sat in the sunshine, eating cake, having done a park run. Life is good. <laughs> Food's ready. <laughs> Off you go then. The post park run breakfast that dreams are made of. Um, chip butty is my absolute favourite <laughs> post park run breakfast. So. Um, our vegetarian version of a bacon sandwich. That is so fun. Um, while these guys finished playing, I thought I would just film an outro. So we've had the most wonderful morning here. It's an absolutely fantastic park run. And once again, the park run weather fairies have made sure that we've really seen the best of it. Huge thanks to the team at Bricksworth Country Park Run. For an absolutely wonderful morning thanks to jip and to vicky and mike all the volunteers it's been super friendly the cafe's been wonderful chip butty excellent highly recommend <laughs> thanks for watching the video i will see you on the next running adventure which actually will be at the run rabbit trail festival i'm going to run the half marathon there tomorrow morning so really looking forward to that time to go and get showered get ready to go on stage this afternoon looking forward to that also so yeah a weekend filled with running take care guys see you on the next adventure